in today's video i'm reacting to a woman that is asking the question why don't women that have good husbands or high earning husbands share the game on what made them successful today i'm here to answer that and i've got simple answers for simple questions but there's a high probability that you don't want to hear the truth so I just seen this girl make a video and she was like, why is it that the girls who are single and serially dating and they have rosters, why are they the ones giving out their game card and giving relationship advice instead of the women who are actually like happily married to what they as well? Then? Let's talk about it. to the most high Yah shalom thank you for tuning in to another righteous spiritful episode today i'm back at it in them trenches handling that kingdom business all right reason number one reason number one why women that have good husbands or high earning husbands don't share the game is when a woman tries to help you level up far as for the sake of a family oftentimes you don't want to hear what she has to say you think she's lying to you, you say it can't be that simple, or you try to backdoor her in your jealousy. If a woman lets you close, you know, and the word saying in that day, seven women took hold of one man, you are not trying to be, uh, you know, in that type of relationship where seven women could have one good man. Like when we read Hebrews chapter 11, when we look at the patriarchs of the faith, no, what do you do? You try to be the side piece because you know that will be the collapse of the house and that will present your opportunity. If you can get that woman to turn on her man and then air this man out like you wasn't a part of the strategy, you know, therefore you think you'll have an opportunity. It's a, it's a real backdoor way that the mind of a woman operates, okay? Here's another one. The second reason is a wise woman is not trying to save all you hoes. Listen to what I'm saying. A wise woman is not trying to save all the hoes and the harlots. A wise woman is trying to build her house. A wise woman is focused on being prudent. You gotta listen to what this woman said. She was looking for game for all the wrong reasons. She wasn't wanting the game on uh, you know how to get access to men so she could add value to the men how she could be a help meet to the man no it was all a strategic hustle okay and this is a bonus right here for all of my women that are trying to figure out what they have to do to be wives you know to be pick me it's not that hard i'm gonna give you some i'm gonna give you some cold game and i'm not the one who came up with this i'm gonna give you some cold wisdom first one you got to be submissive and not selective submissive. You got to be submissive in all things, as the book says, cold game. You got to be modest. A lot of y'all trying to wear the, the attire of harlot and you, you trying to justify that you are modest. No, you got to be modest. Don't no man want no high risk investment as a woman, meaning you're constantly advertising, but you, you with your lips, oh, I'm for you. No, don't no man want that. The next one is be cooperative instead of contentious. Cooperative instead of contentious. Next one, know when to shut up. You don't always have to get the last word. The word says a woman of a quiet and meek spirit is very precious in the sight of the most high. The last one, quit being selfish. Quit trying to think that a man is supposed to lead based upon your every desire, your every whim. Inheritance is laid up by the father, but a prudent wife is from the Lord. As a prudent wife, you need to be thinking about the future. Hey, we got these kids. We got these grandbabies. I don't need that Birkin bag. I don't need these red bottoms. You know, such and such is gonna need this and need that. See, oftentimes y'all like to call men deadbeats after he didn't bought you these red bottoms, after these doggone men didn't bought you these Birkin bags, all of this nonsense. They say, oh yeah, the kids needed clothes, but you sitting up there with a with a with a uh, uh, a thousand dollar pocketbook, a pair of eight hundred dollar shoes on. Come on now, come on. I told you this was a cold game. A lot of y'all can't handle the truth. I got simple answers for simple questions. Close to the y'all ministries kicking it gun barrel straight. 